Good morning, my name is Tim Pruitt. I'm the Executive Director of the Accountability Courts here in Douglas County. I oversee day-to-day -day operations of those courts. The thing I think most people don't know about the Accountability Courts is that currently we operate over 35 homeless and transitional beds here in the community. Giving people safe shelter allows us the first steps to rebuild their lives. Hello, my name is Teresa Gordy and I'm an executive assistant with the Accountability Court Programs. I assist Mr. Pruitt with administrative duties such as accounting, grant writing administration, and the day-to-day -day operations of our office. The Accountability Courts are truly a place of recovery. Our staff is dedicated to the recovery of our participants and there is nothing more rewarding than seeing a participant graduate and move on to have a happy and productive life. My name is Jakia Griffin and I am the Assistant Director for Veterans Court. I assist our veterans with addressing their underlying needs and underlying conditions to help them regain stability. One thing that I wish everyone knew about accountability courts is just that they're efficacious, they work, um, and they are life-changing. Hey, I'm Karen Alexander. I'm the Senior Case Manager for Felony Accountability Courts. I help our clients get through uh, accountability courts and help them solve their problems. What I hope that people realize about accountability courts is that it doesn't just take a team um, that works on the accountability courts, it takes the whole community. And my hope is that everyone gets involved so that clients can become productive citizens and live a sober life. It's Kenneth Britton. Uh, I work with the uh, Hope Court. I'm a case manager. In accountability court, we assist them. It's uh, unbelievable, the resources, the shelter, uh, housing, the uh, CSB appointments, uh, the mental health therapists, the counts, it's amazing. I've never seen anything like this before and it's a one-stop shop. My name's Josh Nation. I am the uh, clinical director of the Douglas County State and Superior Courts. I'm in charge of the treatment side of the accountability court. In 2019, former Governor Nathan Deal, uh, he publicly stated that the Douglas County accountability courts were the most innovative in the state. My name is George Walker. I'm one of the treatment counselors for the Douglasville uh, Drug Court. I uh, basically spend my time giving addictions counseling to people and cognitive skills therapy to people. I recommend this drug court because research has pr proven that uh, people in accountability courts are, uh, have better outcomes. Hi, my name is Emily Hines. I'm a licensed professional counselor and employee of Willowbrook at Tanner. Um, I provide largely mental health um, treatment to the participants. I also provide some, some, some substance use counseling as well. Um, I provide treatment in the forms of group and individual sessions and on occasion family sessions as well. What I wish people knew about accountability courts is that it's a lifeline to a lot of people who did not have healthy childhoods. Um, many people who recidivate due to issues related to addiction and mental illness were raised in environments where substance use was very normal in the home or uh, they were diagnosed and did not uh, uh, keep up with treatment. My name is Fred Davis. Um, I've been uh, here in Douglas County alone 53 years. Um, Drug court saved my life because if I hadn't <clears throat> wasn't able to get in drug court uh, two years ago, um, I don't think I'd be here now to present this here. It's uh, I don't regret not now day of uh, taking drug court because it saved my life. Hi, my name's Anthony Nicolosi. Everybody calls me Nick, and I am a reentry specialist with the Accountability Courts. When clients come in. We get them acclimated to the, uh, the system and get them on drug testing, see if they need transportation, clothing, food, um, anything they need to start this journey with drug court. So I am Malaysia Gentry and I'm the case manager for Felony Drug Court. I provide our clients with community resources, record client progress, and assist them with life skills so that they can achieve their goals. I wish people knew that accountability courts work. It's Thaddeus Rollins and I work with the Veterans Drug Court as a peer recovery specialist. Uh, we save lives, we help veterans improve their uh, quality of life. My name is Joey Bridgers, I'm the housing case manager for Douglas County Accountability Court. I have the privilege of helping men and women that uh, were formerly homeless get housing uh, within the community, uh, so it's very rewarding. Um, it's a great opportunity to help our clients and individuals have a, another shot at life.